Let's take a look at a few equivalent fractions for 4 ninths, that's 4 over 9. And what we're really trying to do, is we're trying to find another fraction that has the same value but a different numerator and a different denominator. So we could multiply 4 ninths by 1, that wouldn't change the value. But instead of 1, let's multiply it by 2 over 2. Because 2 divided by 2, that's still 1. We're not changing the value. But now we have our 2 times 4, that gives us 8. 2 times 9, that gives us 18. And we have an equivalent fraction for 4 ninths. If you divide 4 by 9 or 8 by 18, you get 0 0.4. And that 4 just keeps repeating. Let's do another one. How about 3 over 3? Again, 3 divided by 3 is 1. We're not changing the value. 3 times 4 is 12. 3 times 9 is 27. That's an equivalent fraction for 4 ninths. If you divide 12 by 27, you get the same thing. One last one. How about 7 over 7? So 28 over 63, that's an equivalent fraction to 4 ninths, or 8 eighteenths, or 12 twenty-seventh. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.